Hi, we're back in the daily halacha, continuing on the laws of interpersonal relationships, <clears throat> verbal abuse. It is forbidden to embarrass any Jews, as the Torah says, do not bear a sin because of him. In other words, what does that mean? Even when engaging in the mitzvah of rebuke, for example, which of necessity will inevitably hurt another person's feelings. It is still forbidden to embarrass him. And if this is said about rebuking, how much more severe it is to cause embarrassment when there is no justification at all. One who shames a person in front of others to the point that the embarrassment is evident on his face, loses his portions in the world to come, as it's stated in the Gemara. We find in very common social settings, a person has to take extreme caution not to cause embarrassment to any adult or child. For example, we find in social settings people sometimes call each other by embarrassing names or remind them of events in their past of which they are ashamed, which is also under the prohibition of verbal abuse. People may react to foolish remarks made unthinkably with ridicule or the derisive looks causing the speaker intense chagrin. Or some people embarrass children in the presence of their friends. Someone who causes a convert distress violates several additional prohibition, making his transgression even more severe. It is also a severe prohibition to cause distress to a widow, orphan, or any other disadvantaged or misfortune person. Even through a slight gesture of facial expression can also be considered as verbal abuse. The extreme gravity of this prohibition is portrayed by the following story. When the Romans led <coughs> Rabban Shib'on, the Nasi, and Rabbi Ishmael Kohen Gadol to be martyred, Rabban Shimon was upset because he didn't know how, know for what sin he has been martyred. Said Rabbi Ishmael, perhaps a disadvantaged person came to you for judgment or to ask a question and you made him wait until until you finished your drink or donned your talis or finished your nap. Yet the Torah says if you shall if you shall oppress them in any way of however slight, my wrath shall be kindled, and I shall kill you with the sword. Rabban Shimon, Rabban Shimon replied, Rabbi, you have comforted me knowing that that was the reason, even though it was something so slight, even more so, a person has to be careful not to actively distress anyone.